everybody, it's me again, and welcome, after a long hiatus over the holidays, to Assassin's Creed Origins. You may notice that uh, after the last shenanigans episode I uploaded, which at this point is episode 11, I believe, the episode with my first tomb, I was only a level 16. I am now a level 20. I did a little bit off camera, no side quests, I did not touch any side quests off camera, okay? I just went around, did mostly boring stuff, discovering new territories, murdering guards, which we'll see plenty of in the future, collecting treasures, you know, st stuff like that. It's been, it's always busy over the holidays, so I'm sorry about the, the hiatus, but we're back now with the story and uh, Flamingo. I wanted to show you guys, because I explained at the beginning of the very first episode of Origins, before we even started the game, that my my collector's edition, which you see behind me still, is... It, it was delayed, and I had to wait a couple extra days for it. And you may also notice back here, you can't see my other two lithographs here anywhere anymore. That's because they... Let me back up a bit. <laughs> they are right here. Pardon the glare on the window, but see, there's one lithograph here and one here. These came with my collector's edition. This is the lithograph that Ubisoft sent me. It's a 9x12, and it's gorgeous. And this down here is the letter that they sent um, with the lithograph. And it says, hello, assassin. How cool is that? Once again, we want to apologize for the delay and fulfillment of your Assassin's Creed Origins order, which is totally fine. As promised, enclosed is a very, very limited Assassin's Creed Origins lithograph. It has been printed solely for you and will never be available for sale to other customers. The artwork is a unique early concept, concept of Bayek and Senu, created by artist Vincent... Mm, I'm gonna butcher your name because it's French. All of you who watch me play Unity, you know how I butcher French. Uh, artist Vincent Gainu, Gainu, G-A-I-G-N-E-U-X, uh, from the Montreal Ubisoft Studio. We sincerely hope you enjoy this artwork, and thank you again for your patience and understanding, the Ubisoft Store team. So yeah, I have a, all three lithographs plus the letter in this frame here, and it goes up on my wall over there, but I took it down so I could show it to you. So yeah, I finally have my lithograph. Isn't that cool? So, it's so awesome, and yeah, so a lot has happened since the last time we played this game, and it's been equally long since I've actually played it, so like, seriously, I have no idea what I'm doing anymore and I'm gonna die. But, okay, so we're back to doing the story. I'm here in- where am I even? Hold on. I am in... Sao Village. I never ventured out of this area. I was just- getting viewpoints and clearing out enemy outposts and stuff like that in this particular area of the map. I never left this area because we'd seen a lot of it already, but don't you worry about a thing because we have a lot more of this map to discover on our own. So don't worry, we're still getting to the good stuff. But now we're going to be doing the story quest since I'm now highly leveled enough to do that and we were in the middle of this one. When I was level 13. <laughs> nope, that's a side quest. Just kidding. Where is mine? Which one was the one I was doing? I think it's this one. The Scarab's Lies. Bayek meets with Litop... Oh, God. Leader Taharka. Right, that whole thing. Okay. I get it now. I remember where we left off. Let's go do that. It's pretty far away, though. So let me just go to the map. Oh god, it's so far. Okay, and I can't fast travel there because I haven't unlocked that one yet. But whatever, we'll just fast travel here. And make our way over there. Let's not waste any more time and let's get back into the story of this. We got help from an old- oh, that's cool. That's new. They must have updated that. They put little gold che check marks next to the places I've 100%ed. I don't remember the game ever doing that. So that must be new, that's cool. But anyway, um... Yeah, there was this old man named Gupa, I believe, who had his tongue cut out by the scarab because he was asking too many questions, so then here we come asking more questions. We rescued him, and then his family told us about Taharka, who is related, I don't know if it's by blood or by marriage, but it's his son or son-in-law or something, I don't know. And he's been working out in the desert somewhere, and we need to find him to help us kill the scarab. So that's what we're doing. So we're gonna head over there and do that right now. And it's still far, but... Oh, is that dead? Oh, it's a dead lion. Who did 
at this. That's upsetting. But okay, how do I do everything now? Not that. There we go. There's my horse. There you go, buddy. All right. <laughs> Guys, it's going to take me a while, okay? It's going to take me a while to, you know, get back into the groove of this game because it's been a long time. So please bear with me. As per the usual, every time I'm done recording a session of a game. Oh, shit, hyena! Run! In yeah, I haven't been down here before, so this is all brand new. Litopolis. I almost pronounced it Litopolis, <laughs> you can see. I'm not used to Egypt anymore. Okay, so we got some new side quests here. Man, this temple looks cool! Welcome. Welcome to Litopolis. Dream of the great Taharka. Wait, excuse me? Taharka's the guy I'm A new life for. awaits you in the glorious city oh. of Latopolis. A chance to begin again in a golden land of opportunity and adventure. Cool. This guy makes it sound like I'm heading into Disneyland here. <laughs> God, like, with... I just keep... You know, I love Disney, and I love Disneyland... I knew those were horror statues outside. Yeah, finally I got it right! I just love the attention to detail and, like, the level of immersion that goes into Disneyland rides. And just the whole park in general. Can you imagine if someone put that level of detail and immersion into, like, an Assassin's Creed-themed amusement park? You could have roller coasters like the Mummy Ride at Universal. Gotta be cool! But anyway. Master Tahaka. Hello, sir. My name is Bayek from Siwa. I am indeed Tahaka. Grand Planner of Saïs and Steward of Latopolis. Okay, I met your family. nice to meet you. Your wife sent me here. She said you might know about the one called the Scarab. This is not the place to speak. Thank you. For who knows who may overhear our words. Come inside and I will answer you. He who must not be named. I cut my hair again, by the way, just a little. I was looking too mullet there for a while. So, just the back got a little trimmed. So I'm not used to my hair being so short, and now it's like right on the line of the hat, and it's itching the back of my neck, and it's annoying, but okay. You guys don't care about any of that shit. Let's go kill somebody. <laughs> I'm your finishing off the last of the egg very proud okay. of your work. He misses you. Oh, the little wooden You'll toy. be here soon. I dream of my son and his sons following in my steps. Oh, he's giving him lots of toys. The That's world is sad. made by great men dreaming big. What do you dream of, Bayek? Uh, I do not have the luxury of dreams. Just finding the scarab. The scarab preys upon the weak. He is no threat to me. Okay. Are you not afraid of the scarab, Tahaka? Why don't you give a care to Seems other people? Seems to to your father-in-law. What happens to poor Gupa tears me. Whatever my life's work, whatsoever I did to bring that down upon him, I beg the gods forgive me. Uh-oh. Ah, uh, my alcohol! Or his. Bayek, come fight with me. No, no threat to you, eh? Okay, and he randomly mentions the sandstorm blow again. Ah, here we go. That keening is the voice of the reset you. The desert dogs use the storm as a rallying cry. Oh, great. These reavers use the sandstorm to mask their raids. Well, that seems... Stay close oh, great, and you're throwing... These oh, around you. you throw me directly into a fight? To destroy my great work. Oh, that was cool. Drive the neck of the back. I will drive the piece of shit back. They pour out of the storm! Woo! No, this guy, please. These reavers fly on the way oh, shit. Wait a minute. That's actually a problem. No! Ow. Stop it! Let me break your defenses! Boom! You're not still fighting, are you? Oh, shit, you are. Leave him alone! Oh, God. Okay, he didn't die. Good. Now, pardon me while I loot. I'll take that, thank you. You're the only one that had anything, you useless person! Okay, oh damn it, I thought that was an interactable thing. I am all over the place right now. Okay, I'm following you to Harka, go. Right, I can run as fast as I want, I don't have to worry about catching up to him. Oh 
me. That's an ally. Sorry. Ow. You. Distract the enemy. Come here. Gabby. Ow. How do I uh, equip my bow? There we go. No, wait. Why'd, why'd you unlock it? Oh, I missed. No, I don't want that. I want this. Thank you. You bitch! Get back here! Gotcha! Are we done? Are we done? You nuked him. I should probably also show you, like, the new weapons I got, and I'm hitting all over on the wrong controller because I've been playing PS4, like, nothing but PS4 lately. But, okay, so I have some new bows. I have this one, which is nice. And then I have this one. Hades, which is cool. And then my outfit and my horse are the same. And then I've been upgrading these just to increase my damage. And I've fully upgraded my quiver. Oh! Oh my god, you can toggle the hood. No way. No way. Dude, the ponytail without the beard looks interesting. But okay. And then this. I could have ponytail and beard or... Oh, damn, that's so cool. Oh, that's so cool. We're, we're gonna stick with the hood. I'll mess around with that later, but holy shit, you can actually toggle his appearance and his hood now. There's nobody here. Oh, oh shit, there they are. Okay. I'm trying. Ow! Cheap shot. Oh, I was about to finish off your friend. No, hey, do that again, bitch. Aw, oh, damn it, I tried to repost. Okay, hold on. Do you mind? What's the dodge button again? X, that's right. Got ya! Boosh! Do you guys have anything useful for me? A little bit. Give a little bit, give a little bit of your gold to me. Give a little bit, give a little bit of your life to me. Rise up and defend your homes. Show them the feet of justice. Oh, these guys, these guys look like they're serious. Oh shit. do not stray into the storm. I'm try I'm right here, man. Don't worry about me. Oh shit. That guy looked like he thought he was hot shit, at least. Whoop! Oh no, that was way too early. Yeah. Stop it! Do that again. Do it again. Do it again. Not you. Do it again. Well, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you fuck. Oh, come on. Die already. Look at your fucking health. Go fuck yourself. Okay. Ow. There. I'm learning all over again. <laughs> Where are you, Taharka? Oh, there you are. Oh, dear. Yeah, finish him off, Taharka. Nicely done. Oh, damn, that was personal. Alright, off to you, sir. I imagine Sand getting in all sorts of uncomfortable places out here. I'm working on it! Jesus! Got it. Oh, shit! He looks angry. Die, you sons of dogs! Ah, uh, sons of bitches. Bitches are female dogs. I get it. That's funny. Oh, shit! That's not funny. Okay, he's obviously not a fan of the heavy strike. Oh, I finished that guy off at the last second. Alright, 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 alright. Yeah! 
Sit down! Okay. Get it. Where is Tahaka? Where'd he go? Oh shit, this place is getting bad. Okay. Oh god! Payek, you fell upon them like Sovex did! I did! Payek, ride with us! These desert dogs have crossed me for the last time. And with your fierce iron, I know we can end their threat. Perfect! I understand your thirst That's for That's why I'm here. But these bandits are not my concern. Oh. Tell me about the scarab before you arrive. I thought the bandits were with the scarab. Is not the badge of a Magi that you wear? These reapers are a threat to the good and innocent people of Latopolis. Come with me, Payek. He's got one. And once we have returned these curs to the desert they so love, then... I will tell you the story you want to hear. All right. I will join your cause for today. Okay, great. My bad. I thought those bandits were sent by uh, by the scarab, but nope. Just yes, kidding. I feel like borrowing a line from Edward Kenway. I have sand in my hampers. <laughs> it's not the quote you were expecting, was it? Come, Bayek. Take up your iron and join us. Right here. Brave, loyal servants of Latopolis! These guys look like they could use some we armor. We will root these rivers out of their holes and spill their blood on the sand. Hey, babe, hooray! No cheering? Wow, okay then. Where's my horse? Horse! There you are, buddy. Come here. Clear the way. Following you, Tahaka, let's go. Ooh, do they live in there? That's interesting. This task you have put yourself to, it seems impossible. <laughs> Only the gods can know that for sure, Bayek. Not really. And if I do not reach sense. for the stars, how will I know how close I can get? Metopolis was a wonder once, before the desert overtook it. I mean to show the world, to show the gods, that men can conquer anything if they put their minds to it. Perhaps you have been sent by the gods to help me realize my vision. A strong arm, a keen eye. We could restore this land to glory. Well, I, hope I so. have my own great work ahead of me. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> this is not you. normal. What just happened to the floor? Whatever, I'll just ignore it. <laughs> nope, nope, back up, you fiends. Whoa. Oh shit. Oh, there it is, okay. I see now. Okay. Well, best to do this sneakily. And where's my, where's my predator bow? There it is. Okay. Taharka, excuse me. Would you mind letting me go first? I don't trust you NPCs to be sneaky. I'll go this way. Oh. Please. I'm oh, not even going to bother trying to pronounce that hideout. Okay, great. I must be careful now. Yeah, 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 I know. Can I scan for people? Doesn't look like it. Die, oh, no man. Oh, shit. What are you doing, bro? Why don't you just let me handle it? God damn it! Maybe I should get out of crouch and, and do a thing. Oh, God. Yep. The way, what am I doing? Oh, Jesus. Okay. These guys are level 19s already? Oh, Jesus. Yeah. I'll pick up what you have, thank you. Ow! Finish him! Loot, loot, loot. Yeah. Where the heck is Taharka? Where'd he go? If we're not even gonna bother being stealthy, I might as well not. Where am I? Where are they? Oh, bandits! Where did you go? Oh, hello. Who are these cultists caged? Please, Neb. If you have any decency in your heart, free me. Stay here. Wait until it is safe and someone will free you. you I have mean, my I word. already opened the door, so. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. Hmm. Oh, fuck! Sounds like a few bandits are roosting up top. Sounds like they're having a bit of trouble over there, and I'm just kind of over here doing nothing. Yeah, they are. Whoops. No! Oh, are you guys okay? Alright, you're good. Yeah, we did it. We did it! 
Go on, buddy. Damn sot, what are you playing at? Whee! I mean, I was already inside. Why did you have to make me run all the way freaking around? You taking me to that guy that I already freed? Yup, he sure is. Sunday, babe, sit. Didn't get cool. I did it. Okay, we're gonna start this cutscene, and he's either gonna be opening the door or the door is gonna be closed. Watch this. My Damn it! Didn't <laughs> Before you arrived, I thought my dream was doomed to die. You gave me the strength to hunt down these reavers. It was easy. Who are they? Blood fevered followers of Sekhmet, the Lady of Slaughter. They wish nothing more than chaos and ruin. Oh, really? Are they connected to this garab? <laughs> no. They think themselves lions, but they are no more than carrion eaters. And now they will feed the scavengers. Hey. I will bring this priest back to the city. Meet me at my house. We will dine, and I will tell you what you need to know. Perfect. Sounds like a plan. May Ta bless you and the protector saving me, Master Taharka. Ta. How did you Ta. end up here? I was kidnapped by these blood crazed raiders. I thought the road from Memphis to Litopolis was safe. Ooh. It is now. And I will ensure it stays so. You say you came from Memphis. Memphis is home to many priests. They do not need me there. But Letopolis is fertile ground, planted by your hard work. Well, Our things in Memphis. Kisses! I must admit, Memphis is under a shadow. The high priest angered the gods and is cursed to see the doom of the city. Your messages reach Memphis, singing of your vision of tomorrow. I am not here to press it off. Ooh, that thing looks like it hurts. Get it! Figured I'd just grab the treasure while I was here. All right. We will make a home for you in Topolis. Do I really need to stop listening to the conversation? Not really. Okay, so let's go back to Taharka's house, and he'll tell us what we need to know about the scarab, and we will undoubtedly be overwhelmingly underleveled already to take on that challenge. Ay ay ay. I'm gonna have to do like 40 episodes of shenanigans just so we can get through the story. And then there's gonna be everything after the story. I'm I would not be surprised if this if Origin Shenanigans is my first 100 episode long series. I've never done an I've never done any series or playthrough that's over a hundred episodes. And Origins maybe even Origins plus story. Might be my first. A hundred episodes of one game. I could see this game finally fulfilling that. There's so much stuff to do.